Hmm. So these are the shoes that have been causing such mayhem in the sneaker community lately. Yeah, yeah, he got kicks. But like switch. But like switch. I don't miss. Don't do bricks. Don't do bricks. He got kicks. The kid is sick. The kid is sick. Team with raw rock. Cause he got hits. He got hits. What is up YouTube? I'm He Got Kicks. Welcome to my channel. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, ring that bell, that we get all the notifications every time I drop one of these bangers for you guys. Hit the like button, hit the share button, do all those great things for me. Follow me on Instagram at the real He Got Kicks, and of course the hat page Perfect Brims and TikTok He Got Kicks 95. Shout out to Outrage Brand. They sent over the merch for today's video. Of course, man, this collection actually dropped today. It actually goes with the Air Jordan 2 Low that just dropped today. But again, man, shout out to them. Use my discount code He Got Kicks. It saves you a decent chunk of change off at checkout. And of course, man, we all like to save money. They have you guys covered with all kind of merch that drops with every single sneaker that releases every one of them so be sure again to check them out i have everything in the description box down below be sure to check them out save a little bit of money and of course man it's easy to finish out the outfits with you know some tees shorts anything they, they drop a lot of stuff so be sure man but today you guys we are talking about a sneaker that here lately honestly has caused a little bit of an uproar and has caused some it, i feel like i don't know drama it feels like in the sneaker community and even had people in my dms asking me what i thought about it and this and that and i was like man i i don't know i haven't seen a pair i don't know leave me out of it i don't like being in drama y'all know me i come on here shoot my videos get off that's what i do and i talk to you guys respond to as many comments as i can but me i try to you know shoot my videos you know of course that's what i really try to do just kind of stay to myself and stay to my circle of my friends and that's what i do so it's kind of funny how this all happened but i had to get a look at an early pair shout out to hype supply again use my discount code with him as well he got kicked to save you ten dollars at checkout my guys down at memory lane actually purchased a pair of these and of course let me take a look at it for you guys so shout out to memory lane as well but let's go ahead let's get into this sneaker ah, all right guys so you can probably take a guess at what this is, of course, but I love the box. The summer of 96 on the front, and of course you do have the Jumpman Union LA logo right here as well. And of course on the inside, you do have the same thing, 96 right here. And of course, this is a really cool, neat thing that they put right here, of course, around the front on the paper. Looks like, of course, an apartment building in Brooklyn. People don't know, but Michael Jordan was actually born in Brooklyn, moved to North Carolina. But this is actually really neat. So we're gonna go ahead on the count of three. One, two, three. And here you guys have them, the Air Jordan 1 Union LA Woven. This one right here, of course, it's supposed to be releasing in August. And you guys are getting a first look here on the channel as well. You do have the Union LA logo right here. Of course, the wings here as well. And you do have this actual sneaker which kind of took a little inspiration from the Airscape Woven. It was a shoe that released in the early 2000s. It was actually really known for its you know, symmetrical um, lacing system and everything in it. And I think that that was super neat as well that they did that. But of course, in hand, this actually does not look that bad. It looks a lot better in pictures, but we all know pictures don't do any sneaker any justice. But still, uh, as of right now, this is probably still a pass for me. Uh, on the back, you do have BBS right here, which is actually a nod to the owner, Chris Gibbs, owner and founder of Union LA, his wife and her beauty supply company. And of course, that's what you know the Union one this time was actually kind of named after, of course, as well. You do have like a little teal stitching coming around here on, on the front as well. As you guys can see that teal stitching, that is actually a nice little touch as well. You can kind of, you know, actually change up the socks or do something a little different with that. But of course you do have like that woven material going around the entirety of the shoe. And I think that that is super dope as well. And of course they have these priced at 600 here at the store. And of course with it being coming out supposedly in August, I don't think a lot of people are going to be able to get this sneaker, but 
hey, you know, it is what it is. You do have like the little hints of like yellow under stitching, of course. There on the bottom, you do have like an aged bottom look. It kind of feels like like that sail. And of course, right here on the midsole as well, it, it does have that sail look on it. And of course, one thing a lot of people have been talking about, everybody's waiting to see. And I feel that this is probably like the million dollar question and the million dollar answer. It does come with extra lace and it does come in the cardboard. It does come in the cardboard. That right there is the million dollar question that I, it has just been insane that has gone to. You do get the yellow laces. Uh, I think actually low key yellow laces in this might actually be kind of fire, can't lie. But super dope. I think it's a dope shoe. Uh, concepts dope, the inspiration's dope. You know, having, you know, everything kind of coming back to the owner and the founder and his wife. I think all that is crazy dope, but I, it is still a very, very unique sneaker. And, you know, hey, not for everybody. And God, can't get enough of that smell, though. <laughs> that new Jordan 1 smell, everybody knows what that smells like. But crazy, I think it is a dope shoe. It still is a pass for me. I think it's not a must have in the collection now if i have a chance i guess to get it for retail i will grab it for retail of course because you know it's retail why would i not but it's not you know a must have for me it will not be in my top releases of the year in my personal opinion um it won't be in my top 10 pickups in my personal opinion probably i don't know we'll we'll, we'll see how the rest of the year goes but you know there's a lot of better sneakers coming out that i think are just must-haves but all in all dope shoe love the story love the concept love the inspiration behind it i think all in all they put a lot of thought and of course the quality is actually really nice as well as you guys can see here let me go ahead and put their price tag back up a little bit so you guys can kind of see on the toe box but yeah actually really really nice and on the inside you do actually have a Damn, it is actually really nice. You do have a teal insole right there with the white Nike Air on the inside as well. So all in all, dope shoe. Again, check out Hype Supply. Use my discount code. He did have some on there. I don't know if he still does. But all in all, very dope shoe. Like it. Not a must cop, but I feel like this probably answers uh, the million dollar question that has been getting asked for, it feels, the last two weeks. And people have been blowing me up about it and I don't give opinions on that stuff. I let the people do that. I just give my opinion on the shoes and that is the only thing that really matters. So let me know in the comment section down below what you guys think about the Air Jordan 1 Union. This one right here, the woven, I, I think it is again a dope concept. I'll probably give this a seven and a half out of 10. Let me know in the comment section down below what you guys think about this sneaker. Will this be one that you guys will be going after or will you guys be sleeping on it and letting everybody else pick it up? Thank you guys so, so much. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, ring that bell to get all the notifications, hit the like button, hit the share button, do all those great things for me. Love you guys. Thank you guys for everything. And I'll see you guys in the next video.